So this is what I like to do. I have a completely closed in place with a good um, zipper. And a lot of people like to put them into these little containers. Just these cut up little, if you find a, a leaf, you can take that little piece of leaf and then put it um, in a place where it will be protected. So this is, this is one of the eggs. And then I put them over here. They'll be protected and happy until they hatch and then they'll have something to eat but what i do is as long as you don't get it too wet or too um, gross i like to put some paper towels on the end so that it can suck up the moisture and, and keep these living longer and also i have like this full of water and then just put them in or even take a whole shoot and this is working really well. You just put a whole shoot, put um, plastic on on top and s stick the little shoots in. And so they can actually last a long time like this. And it's fresh, um, fresh food for them so it doesn't dry. And you can see like I have some little guys in there. They're just chomping away, getting fat. So the only thing you have to do is just make sure that you keep it clean. Take out the, the dry ones and the ugly ones and they'll kind of clean up the poop a little bit. And just make sure that they have lots and lots of milkweed until they get old or fat. Like these guys are getting. And then they'll just start climbing on the walls. And they'll just take care of themselves. They'll just attach themselves to the walls and they'll make a chrysalis. Now, Remember the whole 98% of the people, of the little guys die? Well, you are going to have them die, unfortunately. You're going to have some deaths, and it's going to be hard. But it's better than um, being outside. And um, if you get one to maturity, then that's a plus. And if you don't, then they always had a better chance than of being outside. And here's like a teeny weeny one. Teeny, 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 teeny